So, so, my beautiful friends of the internet, welcome back. This is your weekend feel good video today, just for you. I know, I know. Before you say something, I am behind other tech items and reviews. I recognize this. It's a wonderful and busy time. Who would have thought? Please, please hang in there. Every single day, I get messages and comments on how I customize and integrate my apps. By the way, any apps. So there appear on my watch face and can be activated with a single touch just like magic no more diving into shelves layers and what have you no 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 and check out this view i reckon not many of you have seen this yet all of my apps can be found nicely in an alphabetical order now they are ready to be activated and integrated in any watch face so let me show you how to do this now hey you as a token of appreciation i wouldn't mind if you consider subscribing liking and or commenting you are simply the best thank you let's go to your wearable app on your galaxy watch 4 by the way you will also need your galaxy watch 4 in order to get all of this going today and you can see here i have the spinning ball i just like to have some colors today i am easily pleased with some funky stuff but let's change this let's go to the digital dashboard first and after that a quick guide for the analog dashboard so let's do this here click on it the customize button needs to be blue in order to work click on customize today we ignore all design choices and go straight to complication one by the way i had some people asking for the barometer app on the galaxy watch 4 well let me show you this here you can find this dedicated app and or view on your galaxy watch 4 here next to the shortcut up shortcut and that's how you can also get your barometer going just a side note here okay let's move on click on the up shortcut for complication one and you can see this for most complications so let's do complication two as well and then press save so you press up shortcut for complication one two three or four whichever you desire to do press save now please go to your watch and now when you look at this watch face you will see empty spaces with a little plus icon that means your app shortcut is ready to be activated by clicking on the plus sign once you do this you can choose your desired app from the alphabetical drop down menu the one i've shown you at the beginning here you can see this as well and you can be as efficient as possible by creating your very own app shortcuts any app you have will be able to go on there so stick with me there's more don't go yet because the analog dashboard may even a better solution for this check this out and that's the one i use for my thumbnails when you guys ask me which watch face that is it is the analog dashboard that can be heavily customized it's basically just a matter of how to do it basically it's a very same process i have just shown you and once you selected the app shortcuts you have the plus icons on all available app shortcut spaces you can see this here right you can choose youtube music spotify google maps once the google assistant is out it will also have a special place in my heart but also on my watch face in one of these dedicated spaces i have just shown you so hurry up please the possibilities are endless by doing this what i've just shown you i hope you enjoyed this video thank you for watching have a wonderful weekend see you next time peace out